The title of my message is called Rise and Walk. Rise and Walk. When I was about 10 years old, can I, can I get real with you for a moment? Because there's a story that happened to me when I was 10 years old. My, my, my grandparents are from Paradise, California. Beautiful, beautiful place. It's in the mountains in, of California and northern, like northern part of California. Beautiful, beautiful place. Forest, you know, all these beautiful trees. And, and so I was about 10 years old, and I'm, I tell my grandparents I want to go outside and play. Well, my grandpa was teaching me how to cut down trees. And so I had this little hatchet in my right hand. And so my grandfather tells me, he says, now, Josh, you got to be careful because there are mountain lions up here in paradise. You've got to be very, very careful. There's mountain lions. So in my mind, I'm like, okay, I got my hatchet and I took with me this pole that my grandpa had made, which was a wooden stick with a nail, three, like a nail on the bottom of it. So you could pick up leaves without having to bend over. (laughs) Best invention ever. And so I, I'm like, okay, if mountain lions come and get me, I'll stab it, right? How many of you guys are like that person that when you're surfing, in your mind, you actually think if a shark comes, I'll just punch it in the nose? <laughs> right. <laughs> so here I am, I'm 10 years old. I'm like, if a mountain lion comes, I'll poke it with my stick and I'll hit it with my hatchet, right? So I'm like, I got this in my head. I, I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. And so I did what any 10-year-old boy that has a hatchet in his hand in the forest does. I went around chopping every small tree that I could. I was chopping wood. I'm t- and even some of the trees, they got too big for me. And I'm like, okay, I'm done. I'm moving on to the next tree. And I'm just having, and I'm, I'm acting like Paul Bunyan. You know, I'm like, oh, and I'm hitting stuff, last Mohican kind of stuff. I'm just going for it. You know what I mean? I'm having so much fun and I'm chopping trees down. And little did I know, I'm just, I kind of lost myself in the woods. And all of a sudden, boom, there was a mountain lion right here. Oh, you think I'm joking. I froze. Now, you see, this is the problem. Before I went out in the forest, I was convinced that if a mountain lion came to attack me, I had my poker stick and I had my hatchet. I would teach that mountain lion a lesson. But I froze. I was paralyzed. I'm t- I just stood there. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. And in my mind, I'm thinking, if you just stay still, it'll leave you alone. It doesn't know that you're there. <laughs> die! I thought I was going to die. I thought I was going to die. I mean, what would you do? A mountain lion. I'm talking like right here. And I was right here. And I'm having my stick, and I'm thinking, like, if I just go real quick, and I'm be like, Ka-cha! with my pokey stick. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll hit it in the eye, and it'll be like, and it'll run away, right? I'm, I'm contemplating. I'm thinking through all these things in my head. And so finally, I mean, it's not like I was singing for like five minutes, like split seconds. You know what I'm saying? And finally, I, I, I get the boldness to look the lion in the eye. You know what I mean? I turn like this, and I'm like, <laughs> and it was a rock. It was, it was a weird shape rock. I'm telling you, because I, I kind of lost track of where I was, and I'm chopping stuff, rah, rah, poking stuff, and pretending like I'm fighting and chopping, and yeah. And I, there was a rock. That rock had the ability. Now, are you ready for this? That rock had the ability to paralyze me because of my perception. Because of my mind, because what I had perceived that rock was, until I got revelation, until I got revelation and understanding, I was paralyzed. But the moment I got revelation and understanding, I was good to go. A lot of us become paralyzed because of our lack of revelation and understanding. And we allow things to paralyze us.